I'm Devin Gonzios. I'm a 19-year-old Greek Colombian kid from Miami, Florida. I'm a third-year student at the University of Florida with a health science major. My life is pretty good. I enjoy playing basketball, hanging out with my friends, studying at the library. One day I was just sleeping and I felt uncomfortable because I felt like a bump in my neck. So a week later I went to the pediatric surgeon. She felt my swollen lymph node. The next week I did a biopsy with that surgeon and two days later it came out that I had Hodgkin's lymphoma. When I first heard the news it was pretty shocking because cancer is like something you hear that happens like to your grandparents or like your uncle that you barely know. You think it's never going to happen to you especially when you're so young. The first thing that came to my head was I can't believe I'm going to be bald. I found the strength to overcome cancer just by walking outside my room and looking at everyone else who was going through it and they were going through things way much worse than me. I had an amazing support system. All my friends were visiting me. My parents were always there for me. All my family was there. My life definitely changed for the better when I got cancer. Actually going through it sucked, but I have such a positive outlook on life now. I try to eat healthier when I can. When I think I'm going through something bad, like a tough test or like a bad study week, I just look back at what I had and think, this is nothing like it. it's gonna be over. It'll be fine. There's people going through way worse things. I'm happy now that I can live back in my normal life and I'm here at UF and I'm able to go to the Gator games every Saturday and just go out with friends and study and I feel like my life has a purpose now to be an oncologist and help, help kids who had the same thing like I had. I've been cancer free for about two years and three months now. If you just let cancer beat you, like it's gonna beat you. The minute you stop trying to fight it, you're gonna lose and I think it's a fight worth fighting for.